Here at the Louvre in Paris, NBC News is getting a close-up look at the works of perhaps the most famous artist in history, Leonardo da Vinci. This is the greatest collection of Leonardo's work ever brought together. And you get to see how he developed his technique and his ideas from drawings to paintings, a technique that revolutionized the art world. He brought his characters to life. That Leonardo da Vinci was the first modern painter. You see uh, how uh, always his figures are always represented like they, were, they are moving, you know, slightly moving. At that time, no cinema, no picture, and so people looking at his paintings, they were terrorized by his paintings. Terrorized? Yes, exactly. This is that was the impression. It's so lifelike. Like, like. Yes. You clearly see uh, his evolution. It's like being in Leonardo uh, da Vinci's studio and discover him just, you're just near him. The incredible thing about this exhibition is how close you can get to these priceless masterpieces. This is Vitruvian Man, one of Leonardo's most famous works. He was an artist, but he was also a scientist, fascinated by mythology and by maths, and you can see that in his work. And of course, there's the Da Vinci Code. His drawings are absolutely uh, incredible, and many also of his invention looks quite uh, strange. And so there is a part of Leonardo who is uh, very uh, mysterious. Mysterious thing about Leonardo, he wrote backwards the real Da Vinci Code. There's something else here too, take a look. They believe that this may be a self-portrait of Leonardo himself. And take a look at this. This is Saint Anne. And this was one of the last paintings by Leonardo. And just here, they believe that these were his last brush strokes back in 1519. They even have 21st century virtual reality to help understand the 500-year-old works of art. There she is. <laughs> and speaking of the Mona Lisa, no visit to the Louvre would be complete without seeing Leonardo's most famous painting. She is so famous. This place is normally buzzing, crowded. To be here alone with her is a unique experience. She looks at us slightly sideways and there's that little teasing smile, non-smile going on. And it's very daring. You know, standard now, we all do selfies and we all grin into the camera. But this is absolutely novel at the time. But beyond that, Leonardo poured everything he knew about painting into that picture. About psychology, about optics, about the geology of landscape. His works uh, have a, a mysterious uh, quality and I think this is why we are all uh, fascinated by him. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.